this is a myth actually and there is no basis of that because drinking beer can cause dehydration so sometime after drinking beer if the people uh, drink large quantity of water that actually helps in removing the stone not the beer itself if you only drink a lot of beer and don't drink water after that it is going to cause dehydration and which can be detrimental which can lead to more stone formation so drinking beer does not help at all in uh, uh, removing the stone or the dissolution of the stone so the most important thing for the prevention of kidney stone is to drink adequate water adequate quantity of water means he one should drink enough water to produce about 2.5 liter of urine per day so it means he one has to the uh, drink at least 3 liter or more than that of water per day so that because the stone one of the important factor for the formation of stone is the saturation and saturation of the stone occur crystal stone crystal when there is a dehydration so uh, it's very important to drink good amount of water then there are other things which will depend on the uh, what caused your stone formation like if you have something which is uh, there is a excessive oxalate in your diet or or you have uh, some other risk factor infection uh, and uh, there are some genetic condition which causes the stone formation so so it will depend on those causes uh, if you take very high protein diet mean in the sense if you have hyper uric uricemia uric acid is high uh, and you have tendency for stone formation so uh, then you have to reduce animal protein in your diet so it depends on the cause of the stone formation but one thing which works for everything everybody is the increase amount of water that these stones can be removed with the help of the alternative medicine and i need to tell you the the ureter uh, ureter which is the tube of the kidney which goes from the kidney to the urinary bladder which is the urine storage is the diameter of that tube is 6 to 7 mm so if the stone which is smaller up to 7 mm or even sometime 8 mm that can pass through this tube but beyond that if the stone is 1 cm or 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 more in size this type of the stone will not be removed or dissolved and in these cases i see many time the people keep on taking the alternative treatment there is a stone keep on damaging the kidney and later on patient comes to us in advanced stages when the kidney is already not working and it become uh, small there is a small stone there are chances uh, that it will pass spontaneously but you should always see a qualified uh, kidney doctor